Hello, I'm Tyler Anthony, and this is your Santa Barbara Newswire update. In response to the passing of Proposition 8 in November, many people are protesting in hopes of revoking the same-sex marriage ban in California. Tracy Jones and Valerie Pageant, a Pasadena couple, are among those affected by the passing of the proposition. To make their voices heard, Jones and Paget are marching from Los Angeles to San Francisco on foot. The couple passed through Santa Barbara recently, and Newswire was able to catch up with them and discuss their journey. Prior to November 4th, um, there was the sense that nothing like this would ever happen, that this would not pass, that California of all places was beyond this and forward thinking. And on November 5th, when it appeared that the proposition did pass, there was this sudden uh, uprising, I guess you would say, of disbelief disbelief, and anger that we are tired uh, as gay and lesbian individuals and couples and uh, the, as a community of being treated like second-class citizens. Our mission really is to uh, appeal to the Supreme Court and we believe that they've, they've already declared that discriminating against one group of people is unconstitutional and we believe that the passage of Prop 8 is still unconstitutional. So our appeal is, um, is the same, that it was unconstitutional then and, and it still should be. And we should, um, we should not use uh, revising our constitution to take away anybody's civil rights. To get more information and to track Jones and Paget's journey through California, you can visit their website at www.revoke8.com. In related news, a resolution opposing Proposition 8 was recently introduced in the state legislature. The resolution argues that Prop 8 is a revision of the state constitution and that it should have been approved by the legislature before being placed on the ballot. The resolution, as well as other legal challenges, are being considered by the California Supreme Court. Lawyers for the Yes on Prop 8 campaign say the voters should be able to directly influence the Constitution through a ballot measure. Much of the activism against gay marriage comes from churches and are based in religious beliefs that marriage should only be between a man and a woman. Arguments from both sides are set to be heard starting in March 2009. So that's your Santa Barbara Newswire update. Remember to check us out here on Channel 21 or check us out online at sbchannels.net. I'm Tyler Anthony and you've just been wired.